this is the day of surgery. It's been about two hours since I got surgery. They wrapped me up pretty nicely here. I've got the ace bandage looking thing. My knee is absolutely swollen. That, you can tell, I'm still on anesthesia. A lot of the meds that they gave me, some nerve, nerve, uh, I guess, nerve ending that they put near my thigh that just blocked all the nerves in my leg. So I literally cannot feel my legs probably for another 24 hours. Just got out, going to pick up my painkillers from the pharmacy. And I'll show you later when I unwrap this thing. Hey, what's up guys? So day one is officially over. Um, ACL reconstructive surgery. It's 8.15 a.m. the following day. Um, my surgery was at 10 a.m. So pretty much, um, sorry about the light, but as you can see, I have my leg propped up. Probably need to raise it a little more. Um, got my meds, <clears throat> everything else. I'll tell you what, last night was rough. Um, the anesthesia wore off and the nerve the nerve shot they gave me wore off. I should have kept a better clock on that. They said it was 24 hours, but it ended up being seven, two in the morning. I just, I mean, I woke up. I was sleeping probably 30 minutes on and off. And um, two in the morning, it just hit me. It was severe pain, extreme. I mean, pain that made me want to cry. So I just increased my oxycodone dosage from taking one every six hours originally. Because obviously I thought I wasn't feeling pain. But that was because of the anesthesia and everything else. And uh, the nerve blocker. Um, so immediately at that point, I knew I had to increase my doses to two every three to four hours. And that's what I've been doing. It's been helping. Uh, I currently have the machine on the way. So I'll give you guys an update on day two when it comes. 